Beach Trucking. Good morning, good morning. I-35 South, coming out of Minnesota, going to Loveland, Colorado. 12,000 pounds. Light load. Hope everybody's well. It's Monday morning. Clean roads. Snow in the forecast, and uh, we're going to be on down the road. We got 920 miles to 90. We'll be dropping any time on Wednesday, and Big H will get it there for payday before the payroll period is up. The pay period is up, however, it's said. Plenty of time, monster load, man. Monster low. They real good. Real good. So anyway, not to brag, I don't want to brag. But you know, I don't want to you know keep saying it over and over again. As a lease operator, you can make money. Lots of it. More than you can with company. I've got to say, figure out the rest. Anyway, like I said, it's a beautiful day, a couple of high clouds, had a great weekend. I went to the load out of uh, South Carolina, brought it up to Minnesota, which I dropped today. 15, 20 miles down the road, I picked up. I've never been loaded so fast. It was incredible. I wish every ship would load that quick. And, uh, yeah. So, take a ride with the big man. Oh, I got some updates on the, uh, my girl. My girl fell in love with the property. And she kind of made a deal. And I told her to back her down last night. I was like, you know, it ain't happening. Want to buy the house yourself? Go for it, but you're getting ripped off. Too much work. And I never work. I never. I was like, I can't commit to something. I never walked the property to. You can't do it. My eyes are different than your eyes. You know, I've been a homeowner. I kind of know, and I've done a lot of repairs. I actually did a complete renovation. 12 years ago in my house. Soup to nuts. And this house would need the same thing. Plus, on top of which needs land clearing. Trees everywhere. So anyway, I don't want to get too personal about it, but she saw my she saw my angle. And said, you know, alright. I said make an offer of 250k. They take it, great. If they don't, we walk away. It's not the only house in the country. So that's where we're at. And uh, yeah, I'm enjoying my, my office view today. Absolutely 
screwed up. I woke up, the thing was shut off, I was logged out, and I woke up to four critical events. So, anyway, I got through, uh, so I pulled over, looked out the atlas and realized, and soon found out that 94 will eventually get you back on 35 West. And that's what we did. So, again, folks, GPS is great 97% of the time, but that 1, 2, 3% can send you for a loop. If you don't have an atlas, you're keeping your fingers crossed, hoping that you're going the right way. So, a word of advice. Don't listen to what anybody tells you. Get an atlas. Save my butt today. I want to thank everyone who likes and subscribed. The channel is growing a little bit. Appreciate it. Appreciate you going for a ride with me.
Okay, Big H Trucking signing out. Don't forget to like and subscribe.